In terms of abnormal newborn screen, so if the level is more than 40, start treatment soon after obtaining the venous sample. Uh, in real life, I mean, sample and the results mostly available on the same day. So in most cases, you can wait for the result. But remember that it's very urgent and picking up the result, contacting the patient and uh, responding immediately is very important. Every hospital should have a system where the newborn screen gets fed back and there shouldn't be even a day's delay in reporting the results. So you should have a system over the weekend, you should have a system apart from the name consultant, who else will get the report if a consultant is on leave. An email system involving the full team is a good option, but email alone is not enough. Uh, it should be a critical report from the lab so that uh, the team is alerted and immediate action is taken. And parents also have a responsibility in giving alternative contact number or email options and so on. So sometimes a mother is too tired after the delivery, she doesn't pick up in the first three, four days, so her dad's number is essential. So think about these aspects as well, so we don't delay any case. And once the thyroid is confirmed as abnormal treatment is started, then you confirm by radioisotope scanning or scintigraphy. This is not in all the guidelines. Ultrasound is suggested in all guidelines, but you may miss ectopic thyroid or a small focus of functioning thyroid on ultrasound. So a radioisotope scanning can be considered before the treatment is well established. So within five days of soft starting treatment, but don't delay initiation of treatment for imaging purpose. So if the TSH is less than six, it's normal and no need to treat. And remember that in babies in the initial days, there is a surge and 6 to 20 is not very abnormal. So if the baby is more than 21 days, then you start investigate and if it's a free T4 is normal, you consider withholding treatment for two weeks and then retesting. <clears throat> so uh, if it is 6 to 20, most of the time we repeat by 10 to 14 days. And if it's improving, we don't need to worry. If it's worsening, you start treatment. And if you happen to do it uh, by 21 days, even with the normal newborn screen less than six, then you may consider uh, treating them as well. If it is more than 20, it's preferable to commence treatment, even if the free T4 is normal. However, if it is trending down, uh, you can wait a week or so if the T4 is normal. So this is the part that we will discuss later as hyperthyrotropinemia, where it's not clear cut whether to treat immediately or not.